everybody! It's October, so we're dressed up for Halloween, so this is going to be our Halloween edition of Umai Crate Noodles. And Kato here is a dinosaur. Isn't that adorable? Yes. And I'm a manatee. Because everything is adorable in this house. Right? So let's get to it and let's see what kind of noodles we got for October. Alright. So we're going to open to our middle page here and see what kind of noodles we got. Let's get to the really big one. Okay. This is made by Nisen. It's Spa-O Shitamachi. Uh, let's see. I don't know what kind of flavor it's supposed to be. I guess... Oh, soy sauce flavor garnished with bok choy. It's supposed to be... Am I holding it right now? Supposed to be reminiscent of a downtown and working class flavor. So I guess a very traditional kind of, you know, snack flavor. So that's gonna be cool. I like those. I like that other one that we had. This one is definitely Korean. This is Jajang Men. So it's gonna be like um, noodles with a, a black bean sauce. And it's supposed to be kind of salty. I don't think I've ever had anything like that before. So that's going to be entirely new to me. Okay. There's another big item in here. This was one of two different flavors that I could have gotten. This one is, uh, let's see, they're both Sun Kia brand original udon. So this is just original flavored. Uh, let's see, what's this say here? So it's got a regular, it's got a dashi broth. And then the other one would have come with um, bonito flakes, which that would have been really cool to try too, because you know, bonito flakes are really fun to play with because they like move when you put them on warm things. All right, what's this one? Okay, this is green premium ginger ramen. Zero cholesterol, zero oil in the broth. I have never had ginger ramen. So this is, you know, supposed to be a really healthy ramen for you. You know, no, no uh, additional fats, it says. So this is gonna be definitely an interesting one to try. All right, what else do we have here, buddy? Okay, this is a very fancy looking one. This one is, this one is Chukazami Kanton Shoyu. So these are, let's see, Canton style shoyu or soy sauce. Comes with an extra packet to give the soup more of a restaurant quality. So this is like, uh, these are gonna turn out to be like, they're flash fried noodles, so they're gonna be like, um, I guess more pasta-like when you cook them. So that's gonna have uh, hopefully like a nice rich flavor in the broth. What's this one? That's a cute package. This one's also made by Nissan. This is Dame Ramen with sesame oil. Uh, let's see, just a regular shoyu base. So again, another soy sauce base. Looks like a lot of these are soy sauce based flavor this time, which I'm cool with that. I like soy sauce. Soy sauce is delicious on everything. All right, we have another one made by Sapporo Ichiban. These are actually really good. This is the first time I've had this brand in this particular crate, and I found them to be very delicious. Uh, this one is um, yakisoba. It's chow mein, and it's just another, um, you know, salty. It's got yakisoba sauce, which is probably like another kind of soy base type sauce. So this one's gonna be really nice and delicious. And let's see. Okay, we have one of our last ramens in here. This is a tiny little bowl. This is snack size. If you're coming home from work or school and you need a snack before dinner. This one, let's see, where is this one? This one is shoyu mini ramen. So again, another soy sauce flavor. You know, even with these, this is like, you know, just pour your boiling water in and go with it. All right, so we do have a bonus item in this one too. And it is a little ramen bowl keychain. Ooh, this one's really full of stuff. This one looks like it's got a tempura shrimp. It looks like it's got a shellfish, probably like a mussel or something, like some fish cake. Look at that. That's an intricate, really cute keychain right there, guys. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed October's ramen crate. Um, I have so many of them. I don't know if I'm going to do any more currently. But this is great if you really enjoy eating a lot of noodles, and I mean like a lot of noodles, so it's really hard for me to get to them, so I'm gonna hold off on these crates for now, but stick around for my Japan crates and any of the other crates I do, they'll be coming really, really soon, so don't forget to like and subscribe, we'll see you later, bye!